Yola, welcome back to more Let's Play Dragon Quest Eleven Blind. Um, oh, I thought I think I uh, solved the mystery of why the game time wasn't matching up with the amount of time recording. I'm not a hundred percent sure, but I think that when you're in this menu, I think the game because you see how it says playing. I think that means that like the game is still like running, so the timer might still be like ticking up when I'm like at that thing or whatever. Um, okay, anyway, boy. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and say Casino totally rigged in my favor. Yeah, I played the uh, the thing for a few minutes. Look how many tokens I got. Um, I think I'm, like, almost right away, I did I got the thing where I got the, um, what do you call it, slime time or whatever, and I got 10 slime spins. And then, um, so it's like, okay, I'll just use these 10 spins or whatever. That should, like, that should give me enough. But then, um, I got down to, like, six spins left, and then I hit four of the metal slimes in a row. And it gave me, um, it gave me 20 more slime spins. I was like, Jesus, man. So I ended up with 26. I was like, God dang. Yeah, I'm just, like, I got, like, so I just did those 26 slime spins or whatever, and this is how much I wound up with. Uh, I mean, Magic Water's not terrible. I guess I do have 22 of them. Jesus. I haven't been using them. But, uh, okay, yeah, all this stuff sucks. Well, I thought that maybe they'd have these ones, like, suck, and then have, like, the million actually be something good. But, uh, nope, everything sucks balls. Uh, so, yeah, so I wasn't, like, grinding or whatever, like, on purpose. Like, that was just how long it took to use all my uh, spins or whatever. I'm actually not entirely sure. Once we go back to, like, a regular casino, will these tokens still be, like, usable? Uh, cause, uh, that'd be cool. I'd be able to get the expensive stuff. So I guess I don't really mind. Like, having, like, a bunch of extra ones. And if not, then it's no loss. Oh, wait, I have one, though, didn't I? Didn't I get one? It said, it said I have one. Maybe I have to have it in Thomas's possession. You know what? I'm gonna buy an extra one too, just in case. Uh, cause I have to like get rid of it. Oh, here I can actually put something back. Oh, wait, so now I have two now. Oh, I thought that one was in like the item bag. I thought maybe Thomas had to have it like on him. Hey, he's got two now. Why didn't it? Uh. Oh, I had to try to walk past him. Oh, okay. Oh, love potion of my own at last. Yes, yes, I know. All right, sweet. I'm now a VIP. You know, it took me, like, forever to, uh, to learn what VIP stands for. I had to have been, like, I don't know, 35, 36? Well, I thought it'd be something, like, fancy. Turns out it's just very important person. It's like, that's the most, like, basic bitch, like, abbreviation, like, ever. <laughs> okay, so now we're at, like, the cool kids club. to the slaughter, eh? Huh? Uh, c can it really be? Damn, girl. Princess? I don't know, her skin tone's a little off. What's a man as dull and her voice has, like, got an effect on it. Yeah, she's obviously it? evil. I Just the skin tone itself would have kind of given it away. Knights of the realm need a cheap thrill every now and again, eh? Well, 
Are you ready to play? So, like, what the hell happened? But, but you, I. What's the matter, Henny Wenny? Cat got your tongue. Is the king's little lapdog scared of a bit of fun? I've been pining for a puppy as it happens. Maybe I'll choose you. If you sit up and beg like a good boy. Um... Jade, listen to yourself, lassie. What's happened to you? Stop all this nonsense and come with us, will you? In case you've forgotten, Mordigan's still out there. We need you. Oh, Mordigan possessed her. I forgot that Mordigan exited the body of um of King Carnelian. Wow, Mordigan's still out there. Well, he can stay out there for all I care. Or maybe she's not possessed. I'm we actually didn't see. Now. We actually didn't see what happened. Well, it looked like Jade was gonna like my kick Booga's ass, but we didn't actually see it. So maybe Booga was able to like pull a fast one, his. like catch her off guard or something, or do something. Apparently, I mean, Why apparently he did something. I want to join your band of do-gooders. She said she belongs to Booga, so he must have uh, been able to like put some kind of spell on her or something. You are a princess of Heliodor. You will behave like one. This den of iniquity is no place for a lady. You are coming with us. Dang, pushing that teen rating to the limit. I'm going nowhere, and you can keep your hands to yourself. What would you know about ladies anyway? Hmm? Tell you what, why don't I give you a crash course? My foot crashing into your face. You know, I like fishnet stockings just fine, but I'm not actually a fan of the, um, see how, like, her crotch has that, like, that thing or whatever, that, like, bathing suit looking thing or whatever? Like, what's the name of that? Where it makes, like, a triangle on the crotch? I'm actually not a super big fan of that. Um, okay, anyway. Uh, I guess we gotta fight. Our name is Jinx Jade. Uh, okay, well, we just have to uh, stay alive until Rab gets his turn. Hopefully, he'll go uh, before... Well, Jinx J did just did go again. Uh, go first. God damn, can't talk. Boy, Jinx Jade is hard to say. It, like, messed up all the other words in my sentence. <laughs> um. Oh, god dang, I don't know. Isn't there a slash that works on, like, human targets? I'm pretty sure I didn't learn it. Uh, flame slash, I don't know. This is probably not, like, a super hard fight, if I had to guess. We need to fight and fight. My friends. Uh, you know what? Let's do this, too. Since Hendrik and Rab uh, still need a full heal, and Silvando needed part of it, too. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Parallax. Yeah, this is a new play session. Um... Well, let's go ahead and uh, do that, and then okay, it didn't work, but I don't know. Maybe, it, maybe, um, maybe it's worth it to just uh, use parallax instead of trying to use the other one over and over again. Oh man, I just noticed how badly that hurt Rab. Rab's been in that outfit for a while. I haven't uh, come across anything like better. Oh wait, I should probably use this. This is probably better. Well, my regular attack is sometimes doing more than the Fappen Slash. Sometimes, right? Um. Oh, yeah, let's oomph. I forgot that we can oomph uh, Hendrik. That'll make this uh, more worth it. Damn, son. I don't know if double oomphing is a good idea. Actually, don't I have uh, that like slap thing? Can I just like slap him? Oh wait, no, this is Rab's turn. 
Well, I thought it was Silvano because he was like right there. He was like in the camera. Um, or maybe he has some kind of uh, some kind of like a status curing thing. I guess not. Um, I don't know. Let's just stay on top of the heels. Let's just multi heal. Um, oh man, I just realized Rab and Silvando are like super low on magic. Let's just see how much this does. Okay, that's actually worth it, I think. Uh, I don't know, snooze. I kind of don't want to waste this turn. I'd rather do damage. I don't know, we only have regular music. We don't even have like boss music, so this this isn't like a hard fight. Okay, so homeboy is double oomphed. Maybe I should oomph uh Thomas also. Stay strong, my loves. Boy, that that is throwing me off. <laughs> Uh, should I just, um, maybe it should just, like, bop, since I don't need, uh, heals, like, super bad. You know what? Even though his MP meter is low, he still has 66. Maybe I should do this. I mean, the fight not might not last long enough to make it worth it, but I feel like it's a good, um, amount of healing, uh, like, versus, like, the amount of magic. It's a good, like, value of, of like, um, of HP restoring versus, like, how much magic it costs, you know? Oh, my God. And, and uh, put him to sleep. Boy, those are, those are, like, big hits. Man, she's still not even, uh, dude. I can't freaking hit her all of a sudden. Did I do this? Is it free? I mean, I don't know, it's not fancy, but it's damage. Okay, well, unfortunately, I have to start using Thomas for healing. Oh man, what should I do with uh with him? Oh, I have the slap move. All right, wake up. I think that's the what second time I've used it. But in certain situations, it is useful. Like I needed him to wake up. He's like my like I have I have like two oomphs invested in him. So like I need him. He's like my main damage guy. Like I need him awake. So that, like, sometimes it actually is, like, a good use of a turn to, uh, to make it so we can hit, make it so we can get his attack off, you know? So it actually is nice that, um, that I have been able to get some use out of it. A lot of times, like, stuff like this is, like, like, you get, like, no use out of it. I like this tap dance. Like, I'll probably never use that. Um, okay, well, everybody needs a little bit of healing, so let's go ahead and do this one. They should have. They should have had it make the uh, the same sound effect as in the uh, the other game. That would have been cool. Oh, uh, but no, they nerfed. Uh, they nerfed the spell and they nerfed the sound effect too by making it like not as good. It's like not nearly as good. It made a catchy sound when you used it in Dragon Quest VIII. Okay, Beezy's orange. Okay, we got this. No! 
Um. I mean, that's like 60. That's not bad. Okay, we just need this to land. Even though his oom four off, this should still be enough to finish her. And if not, yeah, I was just about to say, and if not, then Thomas's uh, turn will hopefully finish her off. Uh, please? Oh, god dang. All right. I feel like at this point, it's not worth it to um to buff uh to buff Hendrick again. I maybe should, um, strong medicine. I don't know. Here's a little something. My God, 51. I'm guessing Silvando must have no uh, magical mending. You know what? I did confirm that, didn't I? Like a thousand episodes ago. Didn't I confirm that your magical mending also affects, um, how much the healing items do. It's been so long that I'm not like 100% sure anymore. But I'm pretty sure I confirmed that, I think. Uh, sends luminary stats through the roof and enables him to enter a pepped up state all over again. What the heck does that mean? Let's just see if I can use any of these. Full force of friendship? Jeez. Uh, well, I can't use any of them. I'm guessing the uh, the red X means they're like disabled in some way. Does that mean they can't use magic? I thought you. I thought it was like a different symbol for not being able to use magic. Well, we have to use hustle dance. Oh wait, I can't. I don't have enough fucking magic. Here's a little something. Okay, can you do something? Jeez. Um, oh, god dang it. I was about to say, I could actually use this one. I haven't used this zero zone. It's actually good for when you're out of magic. You can't use anything either. Uh, I have enough for one multi-heal. Should I use it? Oh, I mean, now's the time to use it. BZ's almost dead. So I just need to heal, just like this one more time, hopefully. Alright, hopefully this will be it. There we go, jeepers. Yeah, I did not think that we would uh, run into a boss fight, like, right away. The great Silvanda grows even greater. Ah, uh, new spell, alright. Ooh, Umfo. Oh my gosh. That's huge. Yeah, that made him, like, way more useful. He might be, like... Uh, I don't know. Come on now, Part of me is like, oh, he's, like, permanently in the party, but it's like, well... Come along with us, will you? I don't know, I'll have to... I, like, I don't know if if other pe if the other people are gonna be, like, better. He might still get, like, edged out, but I don't know. Croupier. Croupier? Why didn't Jade just kill Booga? She had like the upper hand on him. Except we like didn't see like what happened. But it's like, well, it, it didn't show her defeating him, so. I am Booga, Spectral Sentinel, the Raker of Hearts, Smasher of Heads. We've heard of him, right? <gasps> oh, he's the one who turned Octagonia into such a silly spectacle. <gasps> Honey, you have no taste. <gasps> oh, Jade, my pretty little kitty cat. Look what the nasty people did to you. <laughs> King Booga will punish them, you'll see. Step away from the princess fiend. She is coming with us. You 
You've come to steal away my pretty, have you? No, 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 that just won't do. Not after I went to all the trouble of putting her under my spell. Do you think it was easy turning such a lovely girl into a horrible monster? You can turn humans into monsters? Th does that mean all the others are they? <laughs> of course! Jade wasn't my first, you know. All my lovely girls used to be human, and the boys too. Oh, look at that, it's like Pleasure Island. That was the thing from the from Pinocchio that I couldn't remember. It was Pleasure Island, not whatever I was thinking of. I don't know, I was way off. I'll say that was like Peter Pan, dirt. Yeah, it was Pleasure Island where they bring where they bring the boys and transform them. Let me tell you. Now listen here, you. Jade's coming with us. They'll be using her for no more of your nefarious nonsense. So how did Booga manage to put the spell on her when Jade was like about to kick his ass? Like how did he cast it with Jade's like foot in his ass? Tolerance policy towards troublemakers. I would throw you out, but I'd rather crush you to a pulp. I was about to say, hopefully something happens, because I'm in no condition to do a second boss fight. Accept your fate. Uh, okay. Uh, Rab has no magic, but everybody else has magic. Uh, I mean, I might be able to get by. Did everybody else gain a level? Well, I mean, I don't need the luminary stats through the roof. I need Hendrik uh, to have oomph. I kind of don't want to lower defense. Uh, let's try this one. Oh, dang, I'll never be able to get, use this one ever again. This requires all four party members to be pepped up. What are the odds that that's ever going to happen again? It's now or never. This might be the only time in the whole game that I get to use this. Damn, son. It's like a straight up Dragon Ball Z attack. Okay, well, unfortunately, everybody lost their uh, their pep. I was about to say, like, well, sometimes the pep lasts for multiple turns. So I was like, maybe I can use it twice. Wouldn't that be nice? Um. Boy, look at him dancing. I was about to say I can attack Thomas, but he's uh, enthralled or whatever, so you actually can. Oh, maybe I should. I'm assuming Rab's attack won't do that much damage to him. And having Thomas get his turn would actually be useful. And he gained magic from it, too. I was also curious if that was going to be the case. Um, I can also uh, reduce their agility. Maybe I should do that. All right, nice. Look into my eyes. Oh, Umful is uh, the entire, um, or is only uh, one guy. I thought that Umful was the entire party, but this one is slightly raises one guy. This is significantly raises one guy. So this is actually more useful than if it was going to be a slight increase on the entire party. Does this just... Yeah, okay, so that just gives him two levels at once, so I don't have to use a second turn to double buff him or whatever. Um, okay, so that's nice. Oh, dang, wouldn't it be crazy if this worked? 
Oh my god. If Hender can hit him with the uh, with the parallax, this could maybe do like 800 damage or something, some crazy amount, maybe 600. Okay, 480 is fine. I'll take that. Um. Maybe I should do this for like healing. Oh god damn it! It's only one guy. Yeah, I forgot. Maybe I should cast it anyway. Okay, Mr. No MP. What are we gonna do with Mr. No MP? You know. I could switch him to Claws and actually attack with him. I don't think I'll gain any magic with that, though. It'd be nice to actually um, get some magic back. I might need him to heal later. I mean, I gained 11 from that one attack. That's pretty good. So it's not it's not an insignificant amount of magic. Like, it's enough to where, like, he'll actually be able to, like... Um, be like useful. He'll he'll actually get enough to uh to start using magic again. Oh gee, bros. Um Maybe I should umful on uh Thomas too. Hey nice, he's already uh orange. Or yellow or whatever. I know it's still orange, but I just, you know, just decided to call it yellow just so that you could... Versus saying orange and then dark orange, you know? Um... Actually, let's... let's hustle. I was thinking about um, boosting Thomas's attack, but I think healing is more important. We'll maybe do that next time if we get a chance. Uh, I'm gonna cast this. Yeah, I wonder if the game is going to explain how, um, how Booga was able to, like, get Jade to, like, let her guard down to get the spell cast on her. You shall not prevail. Jimmy, Jimmy, Jimmy. I see you. He's not really draining enough to make it, like, uh, like, actually, like, harmful. Like, it's not, like... It's not like a super like detrimental amount, right? There's only like saying like like single digits, right? Uh, excuse me, please do not do that. All right, this might be it. Oh, I think his, uh, his sap wore off. But 300 is still really good. Okay, well, uh, I can't do anything. I'm surprised that they don't, like, gray out the, uh, the spells that you don't have enough magic to cast. Alright, so I guess we're whacking. Could go for the kill. I mean, Hendrick is is yellow, but he still has 194. It's not bad. I mean, it's not like he has like the most a uh, HP, so he's gonna turn like yellow like sooner.
Um. They just attack? How about, uh, let's try a swoosh. Hey, there we go. 75 is pretty good. Oh man, $20,000? I have to remember to put my money away. Because I already had like 38,000. And I gained a couple thousand from that other, uh, from defeating Jade. I think, right? I got like three or four thousand, I think, right? Oh, now Jade's gonna wake up and be all pissed. Oh, that spell. Well, probably the, probably the other spell, too. Yeah, there you go. Aw. Uh, well, I mean, she still looks good in that outfit. Where am I? Hendrick? All of you, what... What's going on? It, it hurts. I think Jade's gonna finish the job. Huh? It's not fair. The house always wins, doesn't it? I am Booga, brightest and most beautiful of the spectrum. I don't know about brightest. You. <laughs> Booga. Yes. Now I remember. I remember everything. In fact. Why is she going, Ko Ken? Have your wicked way with me, would you? I feel like I made some kind of Ko Ken comment in a previous episode. Maybe I didn't. I don't remember. Allow me to return the favor with interest. Oh, is she gonna get some sort of like alternate form that we could like swap between or something? Green orb, nice. Okay, so what do we need the orbs for? Princess, you, your. Looks like there's still a little of the old monster in me. Something tells me it's going to come in handy. Uh, revamp. All right, cool. I'm so sorry. You must have been so worried about me. Ah, didn't he give us a second thought, lassie? You're yeah, I think it's cool when uh, characters like get some sort of like little thing that like only they can use. You know, princess. Like there has been some overlap with abilities and spells. But when a character has something that's like unique to them, I think that's cool. I ask only that you understand that all I do. I do that the Lord of Shadows might be defeated. What kind of way to say hello is that, Henny Wenny? Less of the nightly nonsense, or I'll have to spank you. Uh oh, I, uh. Oh, I'm only joking. <laughs> I was about to say, why is she talking to him like that? Thanks for always being there, Hendrik. I mean that. I kind of didn't think that she would make a joke like that. But I guess not. Something's changed since I last saw you. You seem tougher. Yeah, I had a dramatic eye open, so now I'm like awesome. Here. I think you'd better have this. Oh, it's the underwater harp, right? Oh, okay. I found it on my travels. And I've been ah, dang, to why do her boobs look so huge? Since. You already know how it works. Maybe one of those columns of light out at sea will open up some new horizons. Right, we've got more friends to find, and an evil overlord to beat. 
Don't you think we'd better get going? All right, new panels. Unlocked in her character builder. Nice. You know, I also never noticed that um, her, like, shirt has that, that, like, metal ring that's, like, attached to that thing around her neck. Uh, okay. On the road to recovery? What does that mean? <laughs> we addicts all of a sudden? Poor souls who will turn into monsters return to human form. I thought they were all slaves. And spend the evening enjoying some much-needed rest. Then morning comes. Well, yeah. Of course morning comes. Morning always comes. But yeah, I mean, I've always been looking at her, like, crotch and boobs that I, like, never... Notice the, those details about her outfit. All tokens. Oh, god damn it. God damn it. Yeah, I knew they weren't gonna let it let me keep them. Turns out they weren't real. God damn it. Awarded for rescuing Jade from the spectral sent, uh, Sentinel Booga and returning her to human form. Alright, yay. Now it turns out they weren't real. Yeah, I knew they weren't gonna let me. Keep them, but I was like, well, you never know, man. It was worth a shot. I only had to sit here and spin the wheel a bunch of times. I mean, I don't know. I felt like it was worth trying, at least. Just in case, you know, sometimes the games will have it where it's like, oh, it was like a one chance thing. But you didn't know to take advantage of it, so you didn't get the, uh, the advantage of it. Man, 63,000 freaking dollars. And they're holding 19,000. Oh man, $82,000? Jesus. I don't know if I trust you with that much of my money. 25,000 squirreled away. 50,000 squirreled away. 75,000 squirreled away. God damn. So I had never even had 25,000 squirreled away before? I think I got close. I was above 20 at one point, right? I think I had 23,000 at one point, I think. Anyways. Where do I go now? Probably out. Where is out, though? Oh, this way. Is there anything, is there a store I could like maybe buy something from? Oh wait, we can go to the real casino. Let's hit up the real casino. Oh wait, let me take some money. They just take my life savings? And just like blow it all? All right, give me all that shit. It's like that movie Owning Mahoney. Or owning, what was it called? Owning, um, was that Owning Mahoney? Where the dude's like a gambling addict. It was, uh, Philip Seymour Hoffman. Like, he did a really good job, like, playing that character. He was a guy that works at a bank, and, uh, he's like a gambling addict. And there's a point where he, he um, oh, der, I gotta go like out from here and then turn. Oh, there we go. Where he gives the guy some money and he's like, here, don't let me, like, don't give this to me. And then later he loses all his money and he goes back up to him. He's like, here, I need that money I gave you. Man, that's such a shitty thing to do. It's a shitty position to be like put in. But then again, it's like, well, if you know that your friend is like a gambling addict, if he gives you money and he's like, here, don't give this to me. It's like, you know that when he loses it, he's going to come, like, wanting it. And he's going to be pissed at you for not giving it to him. Oh, I got to buy the tokens. I forgot. Oh, so yeah. So, I mean, I'm assuming no one watching this will ever be in that position. But don't ever let yourself be in that position. If you know someone that's, like, a gambling addict. And they're like, here, don't let me spend this. Like, no, don't, don't involve me in this. Wait, what? A convenient little clicker with which one can count the symbols on the reels of Slime Quest Machine? I'm guessing that's useful if you uh, play the other one. Oh, I don't need these. I already have four. Why would you spend 20,000 tokens on those? Oh, the, uh, the love potion just entrances an enemy. All right. So it's actually not that good. 
Uh, does this do anything? Two defense, ten charm. It's like not very good for how expensive it is. Recipe book. Oh, hello. Oh, for Jade. Oh, hello. Hello. Uh, fireball? It's a material? God damn. What kind of material is it? 80,000? God damn. Summon a great saber cat. Is that like better than a horse? Wasn't there a Dragon Quest game where you ride a saber horse? Um, Drip feeds a few HP to the warrior with every turn. Boy, this stuff is expensive. We still have a third page to look at. This shit's probably more expensive on that page. It's a pretty big boost for uh, Solando. And I already have two of those. What does it mean when these are like blue? Ah, uh, deals full damage to every foe. That's cool. Uh, gradually restores MP as you as you walk. That's cool. Uh, sends spells back from where they came from. Sometimes reflects spells. That's cool. Uh, this is the male version. All right. Oops. Okay, so we have to go to the other one to buy the tokens. I actually went to the shop first. Well, I was going to look at the shop anyway, so it's fine. Um, how many can I buy? I can only buy 4,000, which means that I, which means that the majority of the um of the ones that I get are I'm, like I'm going to have to win. Sometimes you can just like brute force it and just like buy enough tokens for whatever it is that you want. You know what? I don't want to blow my whole life savings. Let's take a good chunk. See if I can win. Actually, I'm pretty sure you can bet 900, I think, right? 100 is just like the minimum bet. Oh my god. There's a lot of money on this one spin. That netted me nothing! Gonna play again? Hell no! Because I gotta go get some more tokens! Give me another thousand! Alright, boy, that was strange. Good thing that can't happen again. All right, come on. Bet it all in one spin. That's like the smartest thing to do. It's like the best way to gamble, right? Oh, fuck you. Fuck you. Oh, uh, yay, yay. Okay, you know what? I'll take out one more thousand. Or I'll take out 800. And we'll just do 100 at a time. Well... I gotta do at least 300, cause what if you what if I get a, a match on the uh, the top or the bottom reel? I'll take out 1,000 more. Oops, goddammit, wrong person. I'll take out another thousand, and then like that'll go with my 200, and then uh, that'll give me three spins. Oops. Oh no, not 2,000. I'm not dumb. Just 1,000. <laughs> All right, come on. This one. I got a good feeling about this machine, which means nothing. Okay, we'll just do 100 on each of them. I mean, come on, you have to win a jackpot with four spins, right? I mean, you can't just get, like, four spins and not win on all four of them, right? That's, like, impossible. Oh, diagonals don't count? Yeah, I did know that, but I forgot.
Okay, well, fuck you. Oh, it offers... You can buy a thousand more. You can buy the previous amount. That's kind of cool. Makes it very convenient to lose, like, all your money. I already lost enough. Let's get out of here. How much did I lose? 60,000? Jesus Christ. Uh, okay, well, I guess, um... Yeah, well, I mean, casinos, yeah. What can I say? Was there a roulette table up there? Maybe I should put my last 20,000 on 23. Um, okay. Head for Arbonia. Oh yeah, I forgot, I'm still going to Arbonia. Oh wait, should I swap out Jade? I got Jade back. Oh, let's take a look at her um thingies that she's got. Okay, so what was added? Uh, I don't remember what was added. Was it, is it like these five? These two, this one, and then these two? Maybe these were added. Maybe these five were added up, up here too. I actually have no idea. I'll have enough for this. Sometimes Beguiling Enemy. Oh yeah, that was one of the ones that was like not worth it. I'm guessing this is not worth it too. Oh my god, super disappointing. Uh, five quick random, uh, randomly targeted kicks that also restore the user's HP. Uh, I don't know, sure. Better than all these shitty ones that I don't even want. So I have to get this one and this one to reach this one. Let me look down here. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I don't I don't remember this one, I don't think. Where you need two claws. You have to go like the claw route and the spear route to get this one. I don't remember that being a thing. Oh, that's cool. It's like an ice attack. Uh heavy damage to the undead. Increases power when attacking with spears. Um I know I only need two to reveal this one. I don't know. Let's go. Let's get this one first. And this one gives me thirty uh, HP. So that's uh, that's Q. Uh, bonus skill points awarded. What? A panel hides a special surprise. Ten bonus skill points received. Huh? Is that just on like a random tile, or is there a random chance to get it every time you uh? You use a thing. I haven't gotten any this entire game, so it must be like a 1% chance. Okay, well, I guess I now have enough for this. So, sure. And we'll also be able to look at that other one. Oh, I still have to learn this one, dir. Okay, I need one more level to get that one. Alright, that's fine. But, uh, yeah, I kind of wish it would uh, it would show which ones were are like the new ones. Yeah, I have no idea. Okay, so we're still going to Arbonia, which is... Which is... Yeah, I don't know. What is this little goofy symbol on the map? Oh, it's a climb spot. What does it... There's, like, nothing up there. Oh, I guess it's just, uh... Oh, yeah, there's a tiny piece of land up there that we can see on the mini-map. It's just a shiny. It's just a mining spot. Um, okay, so... Wow, it just says, find out how to defeat the Lord of Shadows. Okay, I'll get right on it, game. Uh, so which way is... Arbonia? Wait, can I zoom yet? Oh, I have to, um... I have to go back to the ship. I can go to the underwater things. Uh, 
Okay, so the ship is there. So I guess we gotta teleport here. Since I don't think the ship follows us. Was Booga in like the dominant position over Jade? Is that how he managed to to hit her with the spell? I don't think I don't think that was the case. I thought that Jade had the upper hand. So how did Booga manage to cast the spell on her, I wonder? Oh my god, okay, well, I have to go like super far away. I guess we're at an episode. So we'll meet back and um oh wait, there's another weird symbol over on the left side, near the upper left corner. What is that? It looks like a It looks like a mound or something. I don't know. Why is it like colored like weird? Yeah, what the hell is that? I don't know. I guess we'll meet there and we'll check that out. And there's an underwater spot. And then we'll start um checking the underwater spots. I'm guessing that one of the underwater spots or the spots where you go underwater will lead to uh, Arbonia. And I guess uh there's only 3, so I guess we'll check them all next time. So that is going to conclude this one. Thanks as always for watching. Please hit the like button. And I'll see y'all next time. Bye-bye.